So, hi dear Pisces, a very very good evening to you guys. This is Anjali Tarot and this is a journal of reading for all the Pisces, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising. Keep in mind this is general. It might or might not resonate with you at the first place. The second thing, this is a reading from today till the 21st of January for those who are single and wants to know who's coming towards them in the, by the 21st of January. So, let's start. Okay, if you want to be a professional tarot card reader like me, you can start your journey by purchasing my course. The link is in the description box for the same. It's in simple, plain English language, very easy to understand with lifetime access and certification. If you want to start your self-love journey but don't know from where to start, you can definitely start by purchasing my ebook and workbook. It's super easy to, easy to understand, loaded with, loaded with a lot of information and it's super affordable too. So let's start by this. Your current energies regarding love and relationship is, let's see. We have the six of wands, the king of swords and the eight of wands. Bottom of the deck is the hanged man. Pisces, you are putting on this facade of yay, I'm so happy. I'm doing my shit. I got my shit together. You are trying to be an inspiration for a lot of people and it's a very good thing. But inside of you, it's shallow. So this, this show off that you're very happy. You got your shit together. Everything is good is shallow you feel like talking it out to somebody that this is what i'm going through actually this is what is happening with me actually in the real world and this is what i have created uh, like for the 3d world because i'm not feeling what i should feel or i'm not getting in touch i'm not in tune with my emotions and it's difficult for me to tell anybody else so i'm telling it to you so you feel like you should talk to a particular person or energy it could be a friend it could be a sibling it could be anybody you, you feel like talking it out to somebody with whom you like uh, the person who's not going to judge you they're going to understand you because you are putting on this facade very very beautifully now you are in this mode of let me surrender to the divine whatever is happening just let me surrender to the divine might be i'm not able to get some kind of lesson out of this there's something that, that that's hidden there's something that needs to be learned and I'm not able to do that because I'm continuously putting on this mask of I'm okay. I don't need it. I don't need anything. And then, da, 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 da. Okay. Let's see who's coming towards it till the 21st of January. Pisces. We have the Empress, the Seven of Swords and the Knight of Swords. Okay. A liar, a cheater in the form of an Empress. I think somebody is a player, but they are going to show you that they are very committed, very beautiful, very kind-hearted, very nurturing, and they can give you the world. I highly, highly recommend not to trust. If something or someone is too good to be true, just get out of there and never look back because this is someone who is a liar, who's a liar, who's a player, who's, who have a history of hurting people. Now, this person is going to hurt you like crazy and they are going to run away, but they are going to portray you like they are the best person on the earth. Why the hell are you attracting this kind of energy? Because you are not being true and honest with yourself when it comes to what you are feeling, what you are going through, what is happening inside of you. You might be portraying other people. See, I have a, I have a thug life. I am good. So you are you are trying you are kind of attracting that kind of energy. And now I'm not saying you're a player or a thug or something. I'm just telling you, because you yourself is trying to convince yourself that you are in this phase of your life, you are attracting these kind of energies. That's not good. So a wolf in the like uh, in the form of a sheep is coming towards you. Just beware. It's a warning alert. I don't see this person as a good person. I do see this person as a flirting around kind of person, having fun kind of person, non-committal, on and off, in and out, but portraying them as the best person on earth. And you might be falling for the trap very easily, Pisces. Let's see the guidance for you guys. Don't overthink. If something, I am telling you, if someone is too good to be true, that is the highest red flag. That is the biggest red flag that you can see. 
in somebody because it's too good to be true first thing second thing if you're continuously trying to con convince yourself that this person is good this person is right this energy is right for you this person is right for you even if you are seeing 100 red flags in them then you are the moron here not them not anybody else okay so you are the one to blame here so stop overthinking stop creating scenarios in your mind might uh, regarding a particular situation that's not good that's not true for you instead of going up and down in and out up and down in and out in and out of the situation cut this situation out of your life the moment it enters in your life because it's going to get uh, like like lot out of you and you are going to be left with regret and pain only please don't do that and if you are having options to choose from right now is not the right time to be in any kind of relationship or even situation ship pisces to be honest because right now you are attracting deceptive energies only for this particular 10 days work on your own deceptiveness meaning whatever you are feeling whatever you are going through you don't have to post on social media you don't have to show off if you are not feeling well if you are not feeling good from inside take time for yourself just shut shut down your social social media and everything just go out and just seek relief from what you are going through and then move forward okay not the right time so thank you so much for tuning in pisces i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste